Jacket. No. Have you looked under the stairs? Yes. You looked in the car? Yes. You're not wearing it like the last time you couldn't find it? Um <laughs> uh, no. Right. Oh uh actually Nick, it's um it's out there on the patio. What? That's my favourite jacket from the regatta store in Port Stewart and it was very expensive. I think I paid $9.99 for that. Why did you leave it out all night? Well, I was checking something with God. Um, I just, just check if it's wet for me, would you? Yes, it is wet. Okay, well, just stop whining. Go and put it over the radiator. Actually, do you know, there's a Bible story about a guy called Gideon. And God asked him to do something quite big to save the Israelites to go into war. And Gideon, mm, he wanted to just check that it really was God telling him to go to war. So he asked God, tested God, and said, God, well, are you sure, Lord? Uh, if it is right for me to go, then can we do this? And God did it, showed him a sign. And then he said, actually, can you give me another sign? Anyway, let's hear from the Bible, okay? This is from Judges 33. So it says, Gideon prayed to God, I know that you promised to help rescue Israel, but I need proof. Tonight, I'll spread a sheepskin, i.e. a jacket, on the stone floor of the threshing place over there. If you really will help me rescue Israel, then tomorrow morning, let there be dew on the skin, but let the stone floor be dry. And that's just what happened. Early the next morning, Gideon got up and checked his sheepskin and he squeezed out enough water to fill a bowl. But Gideon prayed to God again. Ah, oh, don't be angry with me, Gideon said. Let me try this just one more time. So I really, really wanna be sure that you'll help me. Only this time let the skin be dry, so let the coat be dry and the stone floor be wet. That night, God made the stone floor wet with dew, but he kept the sheep skin dry. So God answered Gideon's quest, his request. Now Gideon did ask for a pretty difficult miracle. So he wanted the ground to be wet and the jacket dry. And then the next night he wanted the jacket to be wet and the ground to be dry. Because he really, really wanted to be sure that God wanted him to do this. And you know, it is okay for us to question God and to ask God's guidance on things. We should make sure it's God telling us what to do and not just us telling us what to do. God's patient with us, isn't he? Because he loves us. He was patient with Gideon and he was willing to do whatever it took to get Gideon out there so he could do God's work. So go ahead and ask God stuff and he will answer might not be the way you want it to be answered, but he will answer. But maybe don't leave your mum or dad's best jacket out on the patio. Um, uh, Nick, uh, I need to leave your jacket out again tonight. Why?